the adult behavior will come on next because we have Carly Weinreb, who is a, well, she's a proclaimed financial and literacy whiz. Is that what I'm saying? Yeah. Wow. She's like the smartest girl on the planet. T- uh, the tax, uh, tax, or uh, yeah, you can say tax whiz as well. Tax whiz. All right. She's a tax whiz. She's been on Steve Harvey. She's been on Bloomberg TV, yep. Whoa. Ellen DeGeneres, Whoa. NBC, and she's going up against Pedro and Bilal. <laughs> How you doing, Woodrow? Yeah, I'm good. Are you smart at math? No, I'm more of an arts guy. Or yeah. I'm, I'm all right with some basic numbers, but I cannot even say I'm smart at math. Can you draw? No, no. I can write. You can write. You can write. <laughs> I can speak, but <laughs> I think I'm pretty good with numbers, like multiplication. Yeah. Like I think I'm. If you if you threw some numbers at Simple me, I, ones, yeah. No, like even big ones. I can kind of really? break. I used to be able to break it down pretty quickly. Like yeah. I would just take the short forms, but uh, I and I like I think I took calculus in grade twelve, but I haven't. Sure. Um, I took finite, finite, right? Is that what it's called? Finite math? Is that what it was called? It was so long ago. <laughs> it used to be decent. Um, but, you know, like, it always amazes me when there are, like, super crazy pros at math. And we brought one of them in today. Um, please welcome to the program um, Carly Weinreb and her father, Lauren Weinreb. How are you guys doing? Good. How are you? Good, good. Nice. And, and, and uh, wow, Carly, how old are you? I'm nine years old. Nine years old? My, what, are you, what are you looking for, Bilal? You need a pen? Yeah, yeah. You're interrupting my little conversation here with Carly. Why are you doing that? What do you need here, Bilal? Can we have pens out on every show? But Carly, do you get mad at your friends ever? No. no? Are they always? What about if they, uh, you know, like they're like we're um, we're going to a big uh, pool party tomorrow, and uh, then they don't show up? Would you be mad at them? No. That's nice of you. I get mad at Blau all the time. Okay. Because <laughs> he didn't have pens available. Um, you've been on Steve Harvey's show. Yeah. Wow. A little. I'll talk a little louder in the microphone. What was Steve Harvey like? He was fun. He's a fun. Is he funny? Yeah. Is he, yeah? What, 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 do you remember what he said that made him funny? Um, he was like, I don't even know how to do math, and you can. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> it so, just seems funny because Steve yeah. Harvey said it, right? Yeah. Is Daniel Woodrow funny? He said something very similar. No, I didn't. I'm not funny. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> don't put me on the spot here. No, you're funny, dude. Uh, Bloomberg TV, that's like the big business in the channel and stuff. What's going on with that? What'd you do there? Um, I forget because I went a long time ago. Okay. You, did, you calculated sales tax percentages for all U.S. states. Jesus. <laughs> you know them off by heart? Lauren? Yeah. You, you, yeah. Like, like, like uh, what, what would the sales tax be in, uh, in Texas? Um, 6.25%. Really? So, so can you do that like on a on a unique number? Like, if I threw out a unique number, could you figure it out? Yeah. So, like, if if I said uh, if I went and bought, say, um, well, a dam. If I bought a dam in in Texas yeah. <laughs> to stop the water from flooding my home, and it cost that dam cost me fourteen hundred and ninety five dollars. You could figure out the tax. Yeah. So, what is the tax on that? I have to see on a piece of paper. Okay. For so so, Blau, right? Fourteen ninety five. Times six point two five. Okay. Fourteen point. Okay. Five. There we go. Three. Your father can't write. That's the problem. <laughs> okay. Fourteen ninety five times six point three. Five forty, thirty, five eighty, fifty eight zero, fifty eight, thirty, fifty eight, forty two, fifty eight, forty two, sixty, eighty, five forty, eighty. What are you doing? You're just throwing out numbers? I'm confused. Yeah, basically she's just... Uh, working it out? Doing yeah, the math? Out, doing that? Okay. Okay. 540, 80. 570, 80. Nine years old. Um, six. Five. 86. All right. Is that it? Yeah. That's uh, it's penny off, yeah. All right. That's penny off. That's penny off. <laughs> 
Uh, you have to leave the studio. No, no. <laughs> do you have a good sense of humor? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, so how do you, like, Lauren, uh, why don't you take over here? How, how do you sure. discover your daughter's town of being so good at math? Uh, oh, it all started at uh, Dollarama, uh, Dollar Tree. Uh, we go to the dollar store. I give her $2, $3 when she was like. Three. Is your dad cheap? He's only taking to the dollar <laughs> store? So that's yeah. what's happening there? Is he no, a little that was cheap? a few years ago. Okay. I mean, since then, we put in inflation. I give her three or four now. <laughs> nice. So uh, we give her two, three dollars, and uh, I'd say, okay, here, just do it. It's your money. Do what you want. Uh, and she learns how to spend. So she'll compare a chocolate bar. Uh, this has 12 ounces. This has 14 ounces. Oh, or this has this many grams. That has many more grams. So she'll buy, um, you know, and get the better deal uh, and look for the better deals. Look for the best value. Oh, and then she would have to calculate sales tax on every purchase. And then I give her an extra dollar. Huh. Well, that's so neat. That is such a wise spender. I would just get the, the one that was, uh, you know. The most popular brand. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was thrown in my face the most. Um, well, that's cool. So what kind of game can we play here? Um, well, um, oh, like let's do, uh, let's say you spend something, uh, you know, you go to the shopping mall uh, and there's GST on that. Let's say, I don't know. Talk right to the mic. You buy a shirt sorry. or a pair yeah. of pants. You buy a shirt or a pair of pants. I don't know. How much do we, how much do you want to say? Give me a number. Nine ninety nine. That's is that too, too simple? Easy. Yeah, yeah. Nine eighty-seven, nine dollars and eighty-seven cents. Okay, let's say it's like, where your dad shops. It's a very cheap store. Thirty-nine dollars and eighty-seven cents. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. So 13%. calculate. Yeah. So calculate the GST on thirty-nine dollars and eighty-seven cents. Ten forty ninety-one, eleven forty, eleven thirty, eleven thirty-one, eleven three ninety one seventeen. 397, 407, 507, 508, 518. Yeah, so 518. So does someone have a calculator? <coughs> Punch in 39.87. 39.87. Times 1.13? Times, times 0.13. Yeah. See, your calculus helped you. Bilal doesn't even know how to use a calculator. <laughs> 3987 times 0.13. Nine years old. Woodrow, could you figure that out? Get it? Yeah. Wow. That's very good. To the exact That's panel. very good. So, uh, yeah, and this, uh, this little one does a couple things. And this is Sage, your youngest daughter. Uh, yeah. How old is she now? Seven. Seven. Are your parents bright? How'd you guys get such bright <laughs> minds? <laughs> No, I think it must skip a generation. Must be. Yeah, I could tell because you're not even talking in the microphone. <laughs> oh, sorry. We've been, we've been instructing it, you, so yeah. I'm, just, I'm sorry. chirping your dad uh, left, right, and center. Okay, now I have so the I'm mic trying back. to make this bit funny. Yeah. Okay. okay, so yeah, I think three generations ago or four, we had some, uh, go, uh, you know, uh, some ancestors that were smart. Right? Yeah. Sage, what can you do that's talented at seven? How old yeah. are you? Seven. Seven years old. What can you do? Two digit times two digit. Already? Is that no? Like I don't know. Is that normal? Is that? No, are you gifted? You're you're super gifted. So you could do thirty three times forty one. Yes. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Wait, Bilal, I want Balau to try first. Thirty three. <laughs> thirty three times. We're gonna let Balau try. Balau, let's go. Oh, that's. I don't want that one. I want. Uh, no, not that one. I want this one. Wait, I can see. Hold on. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, let's go, let's go, let's go. How do I do this? Here, Maybe I'll figure it out by the time you find yeah. the sound effect. No, why isn't it going? Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. <laughs> All right, let me think. 33 times 41. So, 3 times 1 is 3. And then, well, it's 33. So, there's 33. And then 33 times 40. So, 33 plus 36 is 66. 100. 28 plus 6, so maybe 144. There's a zero there. So I'm going to say 144 plus 30. I'm going to say 177, but I'm not sure. Uh, 177. <laughs> Sage, do you think that's right? You said 177? <laughs> 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 Pedro! Pedro's here filming the camera. Pedro, you've had a lot of time to work this yeah, out in you've your been, head. You've been, you've been pretty on. quiet behind that camera, Pedro's Pedro. 35 years old. Pedro, come in the microphone, please, if you wouldn't mind. Uh, you against a 7-year-old named Sage, 33 times 41. I'm really bad at that. <laughs> A 
hundred and eight. <laughs> that's just low. That's too low. Yeah, you gotta go higher. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. A lot higher, probably. Uh, What's time calculated over there? What's he doing? I'm seeing if I got. If I'm seeing if I got it right. I'll go two hundred and eighty-eight. Okay. 288? <laughs> you, you guys are super. I know it's like, guys, we're not normally mean spirited, but they're dumb. Okay, no. <laughs> First day back at school, too. You guys got, I clearly never went. Um, okay. They might put you into the split class. You know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, uh, Sage. Sage, a uh, wine rep, wine yes. rep. Um, yes. What is, uh, and, and I, I wrote an, I wrote one down here, so we'll see if I'm close. I wrote it down already. Uh, what is the answer? 1200, 30, 12, 30, 1, 13, 30, 20, 13, 50, 3, 1353. Yeah, it's 1353. Wow. Ding, ding, ding. I wrote 1331. <laughs> he had a pen, and I, I, I don't know. What, what happened to your pen, Todd? Yeah. Oh, here's the pen. Wow, that was ding, ding. That was, that was unbelievable. Yeah. That's crazy. You guys are like, uh, you guys are do like, another uh, one. I, I love yeah, seeing yeah, these yeah. guys guess. I don't yeah, want to. <laughs> rain, rain women. This is awesome. You guys are so oh, good. Do you want to do it on your head, Sage? What? She's asking. She's saying it's so easy. She can do it standing on her head. She can stand on her head? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, so you can stand on your head. I don't know how that translates on radio, but if you want to stand on your head, uh, <laughs> okay. maybe Pedro should stand okay. on his head so yeah, more blood yeah, flow can go to his brain. His yeah, Pedro, yeah. stand on your head. <laughs> I love Woodrow. Yeah. Pedro, stand on your head. Yeah. Come on, we'll hold you up. Stand on your head, and we're going to do math, yeah, okay? We'll hold you. Okay, we'll do something a little easier. 12 times 19. We'll do it a little easier. Try and get Pedro into the game, okay? Pedro, here we go. This is fun. This is Pedro okay, against a seven-year-old. Okay. Hey, Daniel, this is good stuff. Yeah. Okay. Carly, you mad that uh, you're letting your daughter steal all your uh, time here? Because it's supposed to be your time on the radio. You don't mind? You're very, you're very kind. You're very, you, you, you don't get mad at your friends, and you, and you like your sister to have the spotlight. I'm opposite. I'm, I, I totally want all the spotlight. I get mad at my friends all the time. Uh, Pedro, are you still working on 12 times 19? Okay, Pedro's still working. <laughs> I forgot. Daniel? Yeah. Daniel I Woodrow? I think I know it. Okay. So you have a, so Daniel knows 12 times 19. Uh... Uh, yeah, I got, I got 12 times 19. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's... Uh, I have oh, wait, you said times... 12 times right. 19, right? Oh, oh, I thought yeah. you said something different. 12 times 19. <laughs> <laughs> then I don't got it. Yeah. Okay, I wrote it down. Okay, 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 wait. So we'll... Okay, well, uh, let's let... Uh, okay, you're, you're standing on your head. Uh, Seven-year-old standing on her head. Uh, doing the math, standing on her head, uh, 12 times 19 is? 190. Wait, Pedro, what is it? Pedro, what is it? Hold on. Hold on. Don't say it out loud. Don't say it out loud. 10, 18, 228. It's 228. Okay, I knew that. Pedro, honestly, were you at 228? Be honest. Seventy-four. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is awesome. Now it's uh, Carly versus Carly versus uh, Pedro uh, versus Bilal is your name, uh, right? No. Yes. Okay. Listen We're gonna name. do. Um, but Daniel, you throw in some numbers here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Forty-eight times fifty-six. Ooh, oh that's God. a good one. Okay. <laughs> Forty-eight. Plus I don't 48 want. Forty-eight to ninety. Yeah. Write it down. Six. No. Let's let Carly do it. Let's let Carly get it. Yeah. 48 times 56. And we don't have a ton of time here, guys. We got to, we got to, oh, yeah, we got to get to Ari Golkan. I got to end it at this one. Carly versus, Carly versus Bilal. Do another GST. You want to do another GST? No, I want to do this. 50, I want to see 48 times 56. Okay. Uh, what, what is it? What is it for you? Wait, am I doing this? Yeah. 200, 2688. Bilal, where were you at? Is that it? <laughs> I don't know. I, I gotta I'll calculate. Get your calculator out. I can't even. No, I'll tell you what it is. This is I would do it. What did we do? What was that one? What was that one? Oh, yeah. 56. That was yeah. 38, 48 times 56? Yeah. yeah. So what I would do here is I would do 50 times 56. 
So 50 times 56, uh, 50 times 50 is 2,500, right? Times uh, 300 would be 2,800. And then I would minus, and then I would minus the two... 56 is so 2800 minus uh 112 does that give me the math that's that's pretty good that's, that's how good. i would do that well, that's smart okay that's exactly what i would do <laughs> that, that's how i would figure that out huh? um, you're, you're what was it, right. it the finite or the calculus yeah i don't know no, no it's uh <laughs> she got it right though she yeah did. she got it right oh well this is amazing <laughs> anytime we can have a seven and a nine year old beat a 29 and a 35 year old i think <laughs> yeah, it makes yeah. me super yeah, happy yeah. sorry <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the point of that was. Uh, Carly, quickly, you're doing something with the uh, with the UN or something? What are you doing? Yeah, I'm talking um, I'm talking about the tax co-op. Conf- I'm speaking at the tax co-op conference at the United Nations in Geneva, Switzerland. And I'm talking about tax evasion. And it's going to be live streaming on Facebook October 13th, October 16th at 11.30 a.m. Wow. Well, best of luck to you. What a, what a, that's a, such a, a big, important role. And uh, no one should uh, evade their taxes and uh, pay your taxes, especially right here in Canada, because it affords us such great things, uh, like the liberal government stealing from us. No, I'm joking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but um, <laughs> but uh, I will say it's a pleasure to meet both you, Sage, and thank you to Carly, and thank you to your father, Lauren. That was a fun little bit. Let's get you back in at some time after, after the UN, okay? Okay, thank you Cheers, guys. We'll thank be back you. in a moment here. It's all thank the you. Tweed Studios. You're welcome, ladies.